Hi, folks. Ain't that amazing? It's the silverberry. The fruit I failed to locate in Germany for a month. And now on my last day before I leave Germany, I finally find it. And the thing is, I did not fail to locate some silverberry shrubs. I know very well where they grow. I just couldn't find any fruit and I thought that the fruit season is over. So on my first day in Germany, on the 15th of March, I went to the famous philosopher's spot in Heidelberg, which is a very warm and sunny south-facing slope, to check for the silverberry, which is the first fruit that ripens in Germany. In mild years you can pick freshly ripened silver berries even in February. I don't mean fruit which are leftovers from last year, but really fresh new fruit from the same year, which flowered in midwinter and got ripe in February. So I went to the philosopher's part, uh, path on the 15th of March, looking for those cute little fruit here. And I couldn't find a single one. So I thought maybe the winter was so harsh that they didn't even flower around Christmas. And then I looked on the ground underneath the shrub and found some quite fresh pits or seeds. And then I realized, oh, the season is over on the philosopher's path. The birds have eaten all the fruit. So I thought the season is over everywhere in Heidelberg. And then, just yesterday, in a very shady park, I found some silver berries. I shrubbed it at a lot of fruit, and they were almost all green. So I thought, okay, well, a shrub which lost all his fruit already in mid-March, and then a shrub with lots of green fruit in mid-April, there has to be something in between. So on my last day, now I started searching for other silver berry shrubs. And here is one which is perfectly in season. I could have made this video a month ago in mid-April and even two months ago in mid-February if I had been in Germany. Well, now I'm making it in mid-April, but you have to believe me, in good years like this year, you can harvest those fruit in Germany even in February. And not leftovers from last year, like some apples, hawthorn and other fruit, but fresh new fruit from this year. So let's try the, let's try the silver berries. That's what they look like. Pink, slightly longer than a centimeter, covered with a lot of those waxy white dots. Hmm. Sour and with a very pleasant flavor. I really like them. There are other related species in Germany which ripen in autumn. This is the only one that ripens in early spring. That's what the seeds look like in this. One, those are well-developed seeds. That means that you have a, about one millimeter of flesh between the skin and the seeds, not a lot of flesh. Uh, the fruit yesterday in the park, which grew in the shade, they had undeveloped seeds, so the seeds were like deflated, basically nothing, nothing inside this seed husk. And there you had a lot more flesh on the fruit. But I'm not complaining, folks. Those are fresh new fruit in spring. They're tasty, they are nice, and there is lots of them. Hmm. Really happy that I found those on my last day in Germany. This fruit is used as an ornamental in many countries, and most people who have it in their parks and gardens 
don't even know how good the fruit are. But if you are into foraging and especially into urban foraging, this is basically the first fruit you can gather in city parks in early spring. As I said, this year they must have been ripe as early as mid-February. But now I'm making the video in mid-April because I missed out on finding them earlier. Okay, folks, this was the amazing silver berry. So glad I could bring this to you on my very last day in Germany. Stay tuned for more fruit videos, this time from Naples and Southern Italy. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.